Welcome to the All Plan Quick Start Lesson BIM Plus. In this lesson, you will get a brief insight into uploading, managing, and controlling BIM models on our own BIM platform. Let's start with a basic requirement that every BIM project created in All Plan must have. We open the building structure and right click on the project name. In the context menu that appears, we select the restrictions of building structure. In the window that now opens, you can see all the structural levels that you can insert in the all plan building structure. Note that not all structural levels are permitted for IFC export. In the default setting of all plan, all structural levels are always activated. But since we want to create a BIM project or edit it later, we activate the IFC Compliance Structure button. This also serves as a control to ensure a correct IFC export. From now on, only the structural levels allowed for the IFC export are available, and we can start or continue with our BIM project. Please make sure that this setting is checked before starting work on the project. A subsequent change is possible, but depending on the size of the project, it can be very time-consuming. To upload a model to BIM Plus, you need a free BIM Plus account. You don't have a BIM Plus account, but you have an All Plan Connect account. You can link this account to BIM Plus free of charge using All Plan Connect. If you have neither a BIM Plus nor an All Plan Connect account, you can register for free via allplan.com. Back on the All Plan surface, if not already done, we click on Login in the upper right corner. Enter your BIM Plus user data and click on Login. By the way, for future actions, the user data can be saved in All Plan and an auto login can be set up. After successful login, we switch to the Teamwork tab in the Architecture role and select the Upload Model to BIM Plus function. BIM Plus is organized as follows. First, we select the team. Second, we select an existing project or create a new project. In this example, we create a new project using the plus button. Right next to it, we create a new model into which the data is to be uploaded. Finally, we click on Upload and the model is exported to BIM Plus. This takes a moment depending on the size of the building project. After completion, you will receive a notification that a new model has been uploaded. Now we switch to BIM Plus. Let's start from the top. First, you'll see your currently selected team to the right of the BIM Plus logo. To the left of it, there are three lines with which you can expand or collapse the navigation. Click on Open Project and then double-click on the project you have just created. You will now be taken directly to the model. On the left side, you see the project navigation. Here, you can switch the visibility of the components on and off. At the bottom center, you'll find various tools. You can choose among others, measure, make sections on the X, Y, and Z axes,
but also freely create a section through their building. Or you can select predefined views. You will certainly have noticed the symbols next to the project navigation. Here you can select individual objects in detail, view, modify it, create annotations for processing, so-called tasks, or even create their own views. Let's come to the last point, data exchange. You have the possibility to make your model available to others as an IFC file via the BIM Plus platform. We hope you enjoyed this brief introduction to AllPlan BIM Plus and wish you continued success with AllPlan and AllPlan Quick Start.